Peter Chow here. How are you guys doing? Just want to check in with you guys. Make sure you're doing okay. I treat my friends like I treat my family. So every now and then I like to vlog and I like to say how you doing. And then your job is to type in the underpenny section below exactly how you are doing. It's, it's, a, it's a very simple question. And then usually a lot of people say how are you? But they don't actually mean it. They don't give a shit how you're doing. It's just a rhetorical question. Now, a lot of you might think that the way that I am asking how are you mean I don't care, mean this is rhetorical, mean this entire vlog is rhetorical. But oh no, I do indeed care about you, each and every one of you. If you notice, I am using a wide angle lens because I just got this thing on eBay and what you do is you clip it on top of your lens and then make a wider. So now it's a very close. We are very close in proximity. And then all of a sudden you just do that. And you can kind of see a little bit more wide. You can see my Hello Pity, Kitty PJ. So what you do is you take the thing off. If you don't want to see the Hero Kitty PJ, boom. You don't even know what's going on. I am interacting with you extremely close. But you creep on the lens. And Buyaka, you can see my Hero Kitty PJ. Now, I'm not sure if you want to see my Hero Kitty PJ, but I am sharing with you anyway. It's not your vlog, it's my vlog. Which means I can do pretty much whatever the hair I want to. Wow, you hear that? I don't know if you just heard that, but that was a motorcycle. And if there's one thing that I don't like, one thing that grind my gear, one thing that bother me, my number one pet peeve, is the fact that people like to drive by very loud with their motorcycle just to get attention on themselves. You can have motorcycle. I am not uh, looking down upon the guys and the girls who ride the motorcycle, but I personally prefer the Vespa. I personally prefer the scooter because it's a little bit more cute. If you drive a motorcycle, most likely 95% of the time you're a douche because you want to make so much loud noise and get all that attention on yourself. It means that you're a attention whore, which, you know, kind of makes you a douche. I'm very low-key today, just very cheering, not going anywhere, not going outside, just staying inside, laying on my bed, doing a little bit of cheering, doing a little bit of freestyle, listening to some black skinhead, listening to some Jesus. Listening to the new GMV mixtape available for free in the underpenny section below, so make sure to go download that. It is very good. And uh, if you guys ever wonder, whoever produced your song, you know, Peter Chow, who produced Douche? Who produced Fuck Christmas? Who produced the Boyfriend parody? Who produced the Canton Style parody? Who produced the, I don't know, whatever other song that you are wondering who produced for me? All of my song are produced by a band named Gentleman's Vibe, Hippity Hop Don't Stop Duo from Vancouver. And they just drop a mixtape. It's available down below. So make sure to hit up that link and download it today. You won't regret it. It is a masterpiece of a mixtape. I mean, I almost want to just give them money. But the thing is, is that they put it up for free. So that's available for all you to download right now, so you better go and do that. And you know what? Make an account and tell them that I sent you. Peter Chow sent me. Peter Chow introduced me to your masterpiece of a music. And at the end of this vlog, I'm going to feature one of their songs. And then you will make a decision at that point whether that's your type of music. Because not all of you like the hippity hop don't stop. Some of you like the country music. Some of you like the Tim McGraw. Uh, what's another country guy? Uh, I don't know. That's all I know. Team McGraw. Oh, 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 oh. That guy that performed in Vegas. That fly the jet plane from Dallas every day to Vegas. What's his name? Is it Gavin? Ga Gavin Brooks? G Garth. Garth Brooks. Garth Brooks, yeah. Yeah. He's crazy, that guy. Did you know that he performs in Vegas every two nights? But every day he go back to Darius. That's right. He has a jet plane. 
flying back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Now that's a rich. I would rough. I would rough to perform in Vegas. So uh, make me start a petition, Peter Chow for Vegas. Okay, do me a favor. Do me a solid, solid piece of shit. Uh, anyway, I'm going to continue to relax. Remember, answer the question: How are you? And don't answer with just "good" or "I'm doing fine." Give me some detail. Free sentence. Nice paragraph. You know. Let me really know how you're doing. And uh, for you wondering what kind of lens this is, let me take a look. It looks like this. It's very cheap. Let's see what it says. Oh, made in Japan. Isn't everything? Aha! No, most things are made in China. Oh, it's called a Gizmon. Gizmon. Probably cost like five dollar. So, if you need a wider lens, put it, clip it on your iPhone, clip it on other things. I don't know. You can clip on anything you want to. Obviously, it's not going to fit the entire thing. So half of the frame is actually going to be black. But uh, you figure it out if you're not stupid. Which I'm sure most of you are not, and I will see you next time. Hey, 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 hey! I'm talking to you. 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 Stop drinking the haterade, and start drinking the bubble tea. Ciao, Osai, mother. I'm saying we got that stone cold vision, close fist grip, good kid, mad city on my Kendrick Nixon, boy we ASAP mobbing so the vibes long live, gotta stay within the grid or they all gon' bitch, instant no rhyme, it's where all these ferals be calling, denim apparel, I'm watching suckers like cotton, rocking, dog tag chains, got that ballpark swing saying I should go half ass, like they're trying to bargain with what the